just heartbreaking and sad. DHS heard about this little boy after a report came in that he was going in and out of his window at night, going into a dumpster to find food. That eight-year-old boy, the size and body weight of a two-year-old toddler. Put your hands back behind your back. Edmond police greeting 61-year-old Valerio Garcia with handcuffs as he arrived home from work Wednesday. His 36-year-old fiance, Akimi Cox, also cuffed. But you've got a warrant for your arrest, okay? For child neglect. Edmond police say a DHS caseworker visited the couple's trailer home near Sooner and Coffee Creek Road back in February and reported Cox's eight year old son's stomach was distended, meaning swollen and bloated, and he was, quote, extremely skinny and his skin sagging. He stood at around three feet tall, um, weighed 30 pounds, and wore size 3T clothing. It seemed that he did have a very strict regimen and meal plan. Right, have a seat. But it was very small and clearly not enough calories to sustain. That caseworker taking the boy to Children's Hospital, where doctors deem this a medical neglect case. Also shocking and heinous. He's almost my 10-year-old's age, and he's the size of my 3-year-old. The child, once he was released from the hospital, stayed in DHS custody, so he did not go back to uh, his, par his mother's custody. Police say Garcia has a history with DHS dating back to 2006. Cox also with the history going back 19 years. She has six children and police say the eight-year-old was the only one she had parental rights to. The couple now sitting at the Oklahoma County Jail facing two counts of child neglect. Now, we're told the child was attending school virtually, so there wasn't any way that anyone else could see what was happening. Uh, the eight-year-old in seven years, from 2014 until February of this year, had only gained seven pounds. But we are happy to report, I actually saw the before and after pictures, that child has actually gained 15 pounds and is doing well in foster care. Reporting live from the Edmond Police Department tonight, Katrina Adger, KOCO 5 News.